In the previous video, we took a look at setting up OnSong with a hands-free wireless page-turning pedal system called the AirTurn BT-105. With the right pedal, you can see that it scrolls the music forward, and with the left pedal, it'll scroll your music backwards with the tap of a foot, enabling you to keep your hands on your instrument. Now, uh, by default, it's a pretty quick little scroll, as you can see, between the words. What I want to do in this video is I want to show you some options for modifying the speed at which the music basically advances forwards and backwards and some other options for seeing the words of your music, okay? I'm going to go ahead and actually go to this previous song over here. But let's go ahead and go back into your settings. If you remember from our previous video, going into settings and on song means tapping this icon on the very far right of the top toolbar. It looks like two gears next to each other. Tap on that to go into settings and then we're going to tap on settings which is the second from the bottom over here. All right, And then uh, we, were, we were just in the foot pedal control but in case you don't see it you want to scroll the left hand column onto your fourth from the bottom and then tap on that option called foot pedal control. All right. Now in the right hand side you're going to see several options and second from the bottom you're going to see something that says scrolling behavior. Go ahead and tap on that and here we're going to see several options. And first, let's go ahead and experiment with a couple things. First what I want to do is I want to ex experiment with scroll speed. You're going to see that as the bottom option over here. All right. Scroll speed as you can see right now the little uh, button over here is set closer to the left towards this a graphic of a rabbit. So as you can guess, it's scrolling pretty fast. And let's see what happens when we take this and then move this to the middle. Okay, tap on done on the top right corner. And now I'm going to advance the, you can see advance the lyrics, you can see it's much slower. Okay, and then backwards again. So you can just affect the speed of the scrolling of your music by changing that factor. Let's go back and let's just, just for fun, let's just see how the, the slowest setting, go into settings again. You should still be in your previous setup. Go ahead and tap on scrolling behavior and let's just set this all the way down to the slowest level just, so, just for comparison. You can see how much slower it is right now. Much, much slower. Okay? And as you can see, we're getting a, a pretty sizable portion of the music being advanced at a time. Okay? So if you prefer faster or slower scroll speed, you can change those options over here. Let's go back and, as you can guess, there are a few more options we can play around with. Tap on settings, scrolling behavior. I'm going to move this back to the middle in terms of scrolling speed. And as you can see on the top, we also have the option to change the scroll amount. Now take a look at this. If I go to the left, if I change this factor to the left over here and tap on done, watch what happens here. Now it just shows, if you can see, it just with each pedal press, it advances just a little bit at a time. I'm going to go ahead and go use the backwards pedal now. All right, so you're not changing, just you're just changing a line or two at a time. Go back to settings, tap on settings again over here, scrolling behavior. And this time let's go ahead and fool around with setting this almost all the way over here. Let's see what happens now. Tap on done, tap on the right pedal, as you can see, much, much more of the music gets advanced. Can you see that? All right. And then left pedal to go back. All right. Now let's do one more thing. Tap on your settings icon, settings over here. And what we were doing with the scrolling behavior, it was we were uh, moving the music incrementally, a little bit at a time. Do you see the top? option over here that says pedal behavior and after that it says the option incrementally. Let's tap on the top panel over there and now let's do this. Let's tap on sectional. Now, this is a very interesting option here too. I'm going to go ahead and tap on done and now let's take a look at this. I don't know if you noticed this. There's a little red bar along the left hand side and what it, it's doing, it's recognizing that paragraph before verse 2 and then centering it. Now I'm going to go ahead and tap on the pedal to go forward. Look what happens here. Now it recognizes verse 2, at least that header, and then 
it recognizes that next paragraph over here. Tap it forward one more time. Now it recognizes the chorus. You see what, I'm, see what it's doing? It's trying to show you a section at a time. And again, you can play with these options. Let's go ahead and I'm going to just use my finger to scroll quickly back up over here. Go to settings and let's do a combination of speeding this up a little bit. Let's see what happens if you just kind of speed this up and just do this as a sectional thing. Watch what happens here. Again, look at the left hand column. You'll see the line trying to judge where the sections are. You can see it now it's kind of jumping there faster. Here's the next section, verse 2, and then it'll try to go to the next paragraph, the next pedal press over here. See that? Then the chorus, so on and so forth. As you can see, so you can see a section at a time and th that gives you some options. So instead of just kind of scrolling an arbitrary amount, it, Onsong will make an attempt to intelligently recognize where the, the paragraph breaks are and then show you a section, almost like a slide at a time. So some cool options for varying the way Onsong will present or scroll the music in combination with your air turn pedals.